Speaking of in memoriam, uh, feels like uh, w- uh, weird to not mention that our, our our friend, a friend of so many of us, uh, Harris Whittles, uh, 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 was is is lost now. Um, it was it couldn't have been a more tragic uh, passing. Totally, pro- I mean, very much just tragic, just accidental. Like like I and I really like, you know, I would like to take one moment to say to people who every time like somebody when somebody's death involves a car you don't like you don't divert your attention away from who the person was and 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 whether you respect them or not or whether you'll miss them to like spend a lot of time about automobile statistics and the industry and insurance and stuff and here's a number you can call make sure you're insured like leave it the fuck alone if somebody ha- like, like like there are everybody takes cars everywhere every day cars kill all kinds of people uh writers do heroin cocaine they drink they people have different addictions and struggles and th- they are in addition to that human beings and uh if you could if you could if you don't know the person and they died in a way that is symbolic for you politically like could you could you I mean, like, think for a second before you leave that Instagram caption or that or that or that tweet. You know, it's like it's not it's not your time to work some shit out. Like, it's uh, it's just a guy that died, and it's like it's no more it's no more cool on God's part to kill somebody through a uh, a horrible um, you know like pressing addiction than it is uh, to kill them with an anvil or cancer or anything. It is all part of this big shitty world that we were all like united in and um uh, uh harris was uh like if you go if you go online and you're gonna see like how uh, like incredibly like tragic it is that that he would be taken from us at such a young age and he 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 was not irresponsible and he did not make bad choices and he he was very smart and very self-aware and um just very 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 funny and very um like just a just a good guy and he just had a bad accident and and now he's gone and this is the way that life is and um and so go go i mean i've i, I retweeted like an, a, an article that was a really nice like kind of trying to find the words of who was he what you know why was he so cool and why did we not notice um you know what 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 labels to put it on how to describe him you, you, that's one of the nice things about this new podcast universe is you can you can just type in his name and you can go find him on so many podcasts like telling really amazing stories about about struggling with his addiction for instance about about all kinds of things like he was a linchpin of this community and we are uh, like so many of us are just really really shaken by this one it's a, it's a, it's a it's a tough one and the, you want that bargaining phase to be okay so let's all make up our minds hey, call your sponsor hey, put this bumper sticker on your thing and wear this ribbon it, that's that's just bargaining, and it's as healthy as denial, and it's as. Uh, but ultimately, acceptance is the only thing that's gonna be honest. Like like like, who gives a fuck how they died? It's not important. It's not who they were, and it's not it's not. It, there's no such thing as a deserved death or anything like that. So please, just like like, notice how cool the guy was. Go go. Go go go! Listen to his stories. He was a he was an old soul, I guess. I, I, like I had no he idea was, he was that young, really. I mean, I I, that was I, that's a horrible way to find out yeah. that, that that somebody was thirty years old. I didn't know either. He was he was just a kid when he he started working on the Sarah Silverman show after I left. He kind of arrived there um, as, as 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 I left to to sort of fill that vacuum. And he was he was literally a child, um, and was just like you you can't swing a cat in this city without without finding somebody that has a. A good story about him, and uh, and now it's all laced with uh, with this stuff, and there's nothing there's nothing to do but grieve and uh, and, and accept it. Uh, sports corner? No, I'm kidding. There's no sport. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I do. I, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, so, um, uh, oh, 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 let's uh, let's bring out Dino Stamatopoulos, who I haven't seen since he. Uh, <laughs> Uh, 
I just want to say that um, I actually met Harris here um, once, and uh, you know we kind of shared a moment. And uh, I can't believe he's gone. Humble brag. <laughs> <laughs> So there's a lot of humble bragging going on in the wake of his his uh, his passing.